Hello friends, in the previous video we discussed about cytokinin phytohormone, we discussed about its discovery, then its structure, also its distribution and transport in plants, then we discussed about physiological effect of cytokinin in plants. You can refer my video, the link is given in the description box. In this video we are going to discuss about biosynthesis of cytokinin. In the first pathway, we will discuss about how it is synthesized in plants. This is an important pathway and this is known as the IPMP dependent pathway. So let us see this pathway step by step. First of all, ATP or ADP combines with DMAPP, dimethylallyl pyrophosphate and gives isopentenyl ATP or isopentenyl ADP. This step is catalyzed by the enzyme isopentenyl transferase enzyme. Then this isopentenyl ATP or isopentenyl ADP is converted into isopentenyl AMP. It is then converted into isopentenyl adenosine by removal of phosphate group. Then isopentenyl adenosine is converted into isopentenyl adenine by hydrolytic removal of ribose group. Isopentenyl adenine is then oxidized to transzeatine by replacement of one hydrogen atom by an hydroxyl group in the methyl group of the isopentenyl side chain. This transzeatine is then isomerized into cisgeatine. This step is catalyzed by cis trans isomerase. In this way, cytokinin is synthesized. Here, if we see the first step, ATP or ADP plus DMAPP is converted into isopentenyl ATP or isopentenyl ADP. This first step is the rate limiting step. We have already seen that this step is catalyzed by the enzyme isopentenyl transferase. Here, ATP, ADP or AMP is used as substrate and prenyl donor in this step is dimethylallyl pyrophosphate DMAPP as discussed in the above pathway or sometimes hydroxymethyl butenyl pyrophosphate that is HMBPP. DMAPP and HMBPP that are used in the first step are produced by the methyl erythritol phosphate pathway in short MEP pathway. So in addition to the above pathway which is an important pathway for the biosynthesis of cytokinin plants, cytokinin is also produced by recycled transfer RNA which is seen in plants as well as in bacteria. It is not major pathway, it is indirect synthetic pathway. Let us see this pathway. Here DMAPP plus transfer RNA gives prenyl transfer RNA and this step is catalyzed by the enzyme transfer RNA isopentyl transferase enzyme. Then cis prenylation of prenyl transfer RNA takes place and it is converted into cis prenyl transfer RNA. In the next step Transfer RNA degradation takes place and we get cis-zeatine riboside monophosphate. Cis-zeatine riboside monophosphate is then converted into cis-zeatine riboside, which is then converted into cis-zeatine. In this way, cytokinin is synthesized. This is all for today's video. In the next video, we will discuss about cytokinin signaling pathway. If you like this video, please hit the like button, share it and subscribe my channel. Thank you.